Pipeline Company has committed to commissioning the new Mombasa Nairobi pipeline in December this year. KPC Managing Director Joe Sang during a tour of the project in Changamwe in Mombasa said the construction was in its penultimate stages with 95% of the entire project already completed. Completion of the pipeline is expected to substantially increase the flow of petroleum products and displace at least 70 trucks from the Nairobi-Mombasa highway. Francis Ontomo reports from Mombasa. It is one of the top Vision 2030 flagship projects and one that has been on the public radar for the longest time. The replacement of the existing Mombasa Nairobi pipeline that has been in operation for 38 years. Many agree that it is a project long overdue and top Kenya pipeline company officials were here to assess the progress. Today, we are actually at 95% in terms of the project completion. We'll be completing this project before end of year. The construction of the 20-inch diameter 450-kilometer pipeline will ensure sustained, reliable and efficient transportation of petroleum products in the region and meet demand in the next 30 years. The pipeline will have an installed flow rate of 1 million liters per hour in phase one. Lebanese contractor Zakim International is tasked to deliver the project, but even as the end nears, there were questions raised by some quarters on the integrity of the process and settling for the Lebanese company. The contractor was selected through an open process. This was what we call an open tender, where all the bidders were invited through a newspaper advert. The new line is expected to enhance KPC's pipeline decentralization plan into the counties by increasing product availability in Nairobi that will feed into span lines into Western Kenya, Central Kenya, Rift Valley, and South Nyanza regions. Kenya is also expected to tap into regional markets of Rwanda, Uganda, and DRC. The completion of the 450-kilometer pipeline from Mombasa to Nairobi is deemed a game changer in the industry. But this project has had its fair share of troubles, and this time around focus remains on the commitment by KPC to complete the project come December. Francis Ontomoa, KTN News, Changamwe.